Hello everybody, welcome back. Jordan here. And Jose. Yeah, so we just got back from Orlando, Florida, our favorite place in the world. In the world. Is it the happiest place on earth? Probably. Sure is. Well, I don't know about Orlando, Florida, but Disney World Disney and all, world. The, all the amusement parks there are. I swear if we lived there, we could, we would have a channel that would just be dedicated to going to parks because we love them so much. And we filmed a bunch of videos, as you saw, uh, throughout our trip and we posted them here on the YouTube channel we had a great time with that and today we're gonna show you all of the stuff that we bought while we were in Orlando Florida yes yeah, so it's our shopping haul <laughs> yeah also we were trading pins while we were there we forgot to show you the final results so we're gonna show you yes. the final result of our pins as you can see we got some Lego we got some stuff from Disney we got some stuff from Universal so yeah we're gonna just show you what we got the first thing I want to show you is something that I got and I actually got it on the way out of the Magic Kingdom, which was magnificent. Like our very last day, too. Yeah. Like our, it was the, our last five minutes in the park. <laughs> last five minutes, like last stop of the trip. I bought this hat. And it's a Lego Star Wars hat. Check it out. You got Darth Vader. It's not a Lego Star Wars. It's just Star Wars. Sorry, it's not. Oh, I'm so used to saying Lego Star Wars. You got Darth Vader and Luke Skywalker there. You've got uh, R2-D2 and C-3PO on the side, a couple stormtroopers on this side, and then the Star Wars logo on the back. And it's all like embroidered on there, so it's pretty awesome. It's I a wish nice I was, hat. Yeah, I wish it's I was wearing nice this hat. the whole time. Yeah. So I got a Lego Star Wars hat. What do you want to show first that you got? What today? should I show first? I don't know, up to you. I'll show, this is the very first thing that I bought while we were there. So I will show you this. It's a little it's goofy. It is. It's a little goofy. No, it's not, it's nice. I love it though. So it is like the Sleeping Beauty book from the opening like credits or whatever of the original Sleeping Beauty movie. Um, and it's actually a notebook. It's not going to be used as a notebook, but it is a notebook. I actually just want this to look nice on our cabinet with all of our other Disney collectible things. I actually saw this at the Disney store here when it was still open. It is gone now and I'm very sad. Um, and when I went back for it, it was sold out. So I was happy to find that. There you go. Yeah. It's pretty nice. Yeah, I love it. It'll look good on display. Yeah. And I like the gold foil pages. Yeah. Well, you may as well show something else that you got, because you got a lot more than I did. I did. Yeah. I'll <laughs> save that one for later. All right. Oh. That's our pins and stuff. All right. There you go. This is a nice sweater. I, I get think. a sweater on every trip we go on. And actually, Jordan picked this one out, and I really like it. Yeah. So, embroidered it is embroidered, Mickey, and it is all pink. Yeah, it's got embroidery. Yeah. And uh, it's Mickey, and it says Walt Disney World. It's got kind of that... I don't know what you want to call that. I'm calling it like quilt e mm -hmm. type design. So this is my pink sweater. I get a sweater every time. So it looks nice. Yeah, I like that one. It's got. Uh, is it Mickey or Minnie? It's Mickey. Mickey. Yeah, so that was right. Mickey. Mickey's my guy. And it's all embroidered. my sweaters are Mickey. Yeah, that's cool. It's a so, nice sweater. So that's some stuff from Disney that we got. Check this out. I got this from uh, Universal. I was stoked on getting this. He's buying this up day one. I have always He's talking about it before we even got there, actually. Yeah, because like, like on previous trips where uh, we've been there before, I have always eyed up this shirt. And boom! It's a Homer Simpson shirt. Just an enormous Homer head. Isn't that awesome? Oh my gosh, I'm going to go put it on right now. I think it's slightly ridiculous, but... I haven't tried it on yet, so uh, this will be this will be a treat. Oh, it's all wrinkly. I'll have to run it through the dryer. It's slightly ridiculous. Uh, yeah, That's I went okay. off camera for you there. <laughs> <laughs> but there we go. Check it out, man. It's so cool. It's my Homer Simpson shirt. <laughs> That's a big old I am Homer. so stoked on that. Homer's one of my favorite characters. What's next for you, Jose? What is next? Let's show these. Oh, yeah. These show what. Okay. So these, this stuff out we the have way. two of these already. We got from, I think, two or three trips ago. Yeah, and we get these, well, we, we want to make it a tradition that we get these every single time. And slowly but surely, we're going to replace some of the stuff in our kitchen with these. Replace our boring ones with fun ones. And pretty these, classy. Yeah. Pretty nice. We got these on our first night at Epcot, and mm -hmm. they have, uh, from Germany, and they have these really cool mugs. They're like nice beer mugs that are just mugs water that you can use for anything, water, whatever so you like. we got a Donald and a Goofy. Mm -hmm. We have a Mickey and a Minnie already. And actually, sadly, they changed the design so yeah. they don't totally match, but... They have like the tapered bottom. Yeah. These, like, they're pretty good quality. They're fairly inexpensive, like 
considering Disney. Yeah, but they're like 20 bucks. Yeah. 20 bucks a shot. Yeah. So there we go. That's They're more cool. than the original one, actually. Yeah. yeah. So those are neat. I'm going to put them over here because I don't want to break them. Uh, yeah, we got some Lego. If you guys want to see what we got from Legoland, uh, make sure you check it out. Uh, they were selling Lego by weight there because we yeah. bought it from the rather than, a, rather than your average cup. Yeah. So it was a got... really good deal. We got a whole bag of dark bluish gray one by two tiles. I know we have a lot of them already because I found them on my pad wall. Like you can never have too many like neutral tiles. Yeah, I feel it's a like good piece to have. if we ever decide to expand the Lego city or work on the zoo, which we're doing right now, or might have already been posted, uh, then we're, these are gonna come in handy, especially if we're doing other things. Also, uh, we bought one by four bricks, the profile bricks in brown, and also the one by two profile bricks in brown. Yeah, we already started working with them, but we bought three bags in total. Yeah. Ridiculous price. There's like, actually a few like more in here. Two cents a piece, and then yeah. Jose got a mixed bag there of a whole bunch of different stuff. Shall I dump it, or should no, I just explain? No, 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 just a mixed bag. So I got a mixed bag. I got some one by two white plates. I got some light gray cylinders, some little slopes. They had, I found them, like, buried in another bin, but I found some leaf elements, so I just, like, pulled out all of the ones that you see. There's some yellow flowers. Um, All sorts of cool of stuff. A few random there. things, but yeah, this, this is my mixed bag that I made. Yeah. Yeah. And it's a really good deal. We noticed that uh, if you guys have access to Legoland, uh, the factory store selling about weight, way better deal. What else you got, Jose? This one's cool. Here, look at this. Another thing that we bought from Germany. Oh yes. I got. I got I had, a whole whack of stuff. I had to have this. <laughs> If you know me, if you've been around for a while, you know that I love to bake. Bags and it's and coming up on the holiday baking season, so I had to have this. Look how cute this is. It's got a little bow. And this was from Germany as well, so we got it in the store next to the glasses. Hence the nutcracker and pretzel. But this is my new holiday apron. I love it. Hmm. I needed it. It looks cute. It is very cute. And then we got these for our mothers for Christmas. So, uh, in the Norway area, I believe that's what's in here, isn't it? Yeah, in the Norway yeah. area, uh, right next to the Frozen ride, they sell troll stuff. So, if, yeah, if you've been to Epcot before, Frozen, actually it used to be a troll's ride. I don't even remember it, but we bought these. How great um, trolls. We thought that our mothers will love them. They're yeah. like so ugly that they're cute. Yeah, so, so. ugly that they're adorable, right? <laughs> so we got that those. That would be a Christmas gift. Thought it'd be a neat gift. Yeah. And just something you wouldn't see before. Like, I don't know, you, you don't see them anywhere else here in Edmonton. So no. figured we'd get that. I can't remember what's in that one. This is an ornament. Mm. So every time we go to Disney, we buy a new Christmas ornament. Um, I was really disappointed with the selection of ornaments. This time usually I have like too many options to pick from yeah but this time they were like well I guess I'll get this one it's cute but like I wanted oh, yeah. I wanted glass I wanted like a um, no oh. this one's awesome he's pretty cool this is Baymax Baymax uh, here's our Baymax we got him from the Disney Springs Christmas store yes so the Disney yes. Springs Christmas store they have a huge selection of stuff but not what I was looking for but I do like him. He's very cute. For our father-in-law, we got these hidden Mickey socks. Mm -hmm. There's some Christmas. Those are classy Mickey socks. Yes. And then Jose, you got something else there, oh, right? We'll leave this one for the end. Okay. This. And I'll leave mine it's for. Beautiful. Yeah. I know majority of you watching will not care, but I've been admiring this for probably three years. It's nice. It's very nice. The Dooney and Burke purse. Dooney and Burke. It's beautiful. <laughs> it's got like Disneyland and Disney World kind of flags, bunch of characters and some fireworks and the Cinderella's castle. It's very pretty. It's very pretty. Yeah. Yeah. It better be. I love it. <laughs> it's not as pretty as these. Check no. out my new kicks. Oh, yes. First time I ever bought myself a pair of amazing shoes yes so these are like the native shoes they're like slide on and they're pretty comfortable they're gonna be good for walking the dogs going to the lego store just moseying around and of course they have mickeys all over them 
I was like, do I buy these? Do I buy these? Like, yeah. Obviously, like well, cool they yeah, are. I think we got the last like I'm a size ten, and I think we got the last shoes in the we park that were size ten. Two different stores, and there was only one, so it's like we bought the last ones, and I'm all Disney almost. Yeah, so <laughs> I'm excited to wear those in the summer. Of course, they have holes in them, so they're not going to be good any good right now because there's a foot of snow outside. Pretty styling. Yeah. What else did we get? Oh, I got a. I met up with. Uh, I met up with somebody there. Well, we did, and it's, it's Jose, and he actually bought us. Well, he bought me. A Pizza Planet Magic Band. So the Magic Band is how... I also bought a light pink one. Yeah, Magic Bands are just how, like, how you put your park pass on there and stuff. So I got a Pizza Planet Magic Band. Thank you, Jose. That was amazing. Yes. It just acts as your park ticket and all that. So, yeah. yeah it's fun having one because you're wearing it the whole time. But I got this once again on the last day as well. So I guess if we ever go again, I've got a Pizza Planet Magic yes. Band. And, oh, also, uh, I bought a new lanyard on oh, this yeah. trip. Yes. Might have too many holes. So I did buy a new lanyard. It's double sided. So we collect pins and uh, we trade pins while we're there. It just uh, adds to the experience. So what you do is you go to we went to eBay.com and we bought authentic Disney pins in bulk. So you can get them real cheap. Directly from a Disney distributor. And then uh, we went there and we traded them. And this is what mine ended up like. And we do also buy one per trip, so yeah. and we put that at the bottom. That seems like a big fancy. Yeah, I bought the uh, the grumpy one there, and you can see I got Stitch, Jack, some Muppets ones, Doctor Strange, the Bounty Hunter logo, uh, Goofy, Kermit, Mickey, Mickey Mouse Club, some really cool Star Wars ones. I like that one right there. Never tell me the odds, I believe it says. Yeah. And then we've got... Uh, Tinkerbell, all sorts of cool ones. So you can see all of the different pins that I traded throughout the entire trip. I think this one is actually original from the packs that we bought yeah. from from eBay. It's a Stitch one. It was pretty cool. I couldn't get rid of that one. That I kept my... I had a similar one too. That same collection. I had a Dale. So... Yeah. Get straightened. Mine is kind of all messy and all over the place. They're not all straight. Well, I used the big thick I was lanyard. finding it too heavy this trip, so I was just keeping it in my bag. Me too. It was like hurting my neck. Right. <laughs> so I bought this one. It's a big Peter Pan. What do I got? I've got that Dale is matching. I've got Figment, Lion King, a sassy Aurora. I love her. Smee, Safari Goofy, all good stuff. So that's Oops. her pins. Which pins do you think are better? Let us know by commenting below. Come on, you gotta vote for me. He's got lots of larger stuff, but you know, I've got some good stuff. I got the Millennium Falcon. <laughs> it becomes a competition it does. and we trade with each other and we <laughs> hope to get a big one that the other one likes and then yeah. hold it over each other. Yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty and funny. And now, actually, we have a big pin board. Yeah, upstairs. Um, upstairs and we have it like by year and it's we have two sides, so it's his versus mine yeah. in each year. So, actually, I kind of redid that pin board and I left a big space for our next trip, which is this one. So, yeah, now they'll get all placed on our pin board. And so, I'll have to add to the good half and add yeah. to the bad half. And, and it's then... fun because we, you know, when we walk <laughs> by it, we get the yeah, it you know, it brings us a little bit of joy to look Memories. at them and remember yeah. all the competition. Mm -hmm. so. So everybody, there we have all the stuff that we bought at Disney World or in Orlando, Florida because we got some of the stuff from Universal and Legoland and stuff like that. <laughs> yeah, we had a lot of fun, hey? We sure did. Yeah, that's great. Yeah. That's really about it. Just wanted to share our experience with you. Oh, I also bought this mug. Oh. <laughs> I bought this mug. You can refill it. It's at, a Universal, yeah, one of those refillable mugs. $16 and you put as much pop in your Coke Freestyle and then you can reload it every time. So I bought that too. Yeah, everybody, thank you so much for coming on by. We hope you enjoyed this little... Uh, Shopping what, haul shopping video. Haul, vlog. Hope yeah. you enjoyed. If you've been watching and kind of mm -hmm. following along, hope you've been enjoying the Disney vlogs. Yeah, we have one. so much fun when we're there. So you know, it was nice to kind of share that with you all. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that wraps it up. No more Disney talk. Yeah. Well, until next time. No. Everybody, remember to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for some more great stuff. And thank you so much for coming on by. Yes, thank you so much. Bye. Bye.